What groups of men do you think it is um, advisable, actively advisable to order a PSA test on? Men who have a first degree family history of prostate cancer are twice as likely to develop prostate cancer. So I'm talking about men whose fathers or brothers had prostate cancer at an early age. I'm not talking about the men whose fathers died at 85 with prostate cancer. Mm. So at least it would be reasonable to discuss it with those men in the light of that risk. We all had that case where just on a hunch we sort of threw in an extra test and lo and behold found out something was abnormal and followed that person through and they ended up going to a specialist and there's your life saved. Yeah, yeah. It, it is a dilemma, Justin. It reminds me of a patient I had who um, had something unrelated and eventually was discovered um, to have a kidney tumour and they got operated on and they were very grateful and I was very pleased as well. But then I started to find out that um, renal tumours are one of those ones where we've had this rising incidence with no change in mortality. So I'm now starting to wonder, was he an incidental oma? Did I really benefit that patient? So I think we have to also maintain um, a little bit of scepticism about our saves because some of them may be incidental omas as well. So what's a man to do? What's a doctor to do? It's clear that the PSA isn't a great test, but it's all we have. A positive PSA result we know can cause harm, but it also might save a man's life. The take home message is that a PSA is not just another test you tack on the end of a pathology form. To tie this up for the uh, humble GP, the man walks into the GP's office, what's the GP to do? At the present moment, I don't think there is sufficient evidence to justify for the GP to advocate for the man to have a PSA in an unprompted way. Yep. And I don't think there's any risk to him being considered to have failed his duty of care to the patient by not promoting the test. I think the GP's duty of care is to try and encourage the man to understand and consider the risks and the benefits before he decides to have the test.